I got a call from Mr. Shane, whose father I know very well. He's a Russian shiva. He's a really esteemed rabbi. He called me. Now, what is your name in Hebrew? As soon as he comes, I, I we, we go. As soon as he comes. Oh, I'm already practicing. <laughs> Hey, did I miss the whole thing? Yeah, I told her. What's up? Who are you? <laughs> My name is Surly Shane. I grew up in Adelphia, New Jersey. I now live in Lakewood. I'm married. I have two children, Kayla and Yitzi. I'm really excited to be here. It's a very surreal feeling to actually have this actually gotten pulled off. Hi, I'm Andres Sahaf. I've come from Cali, Colombia, a small town in the west of the country. I'm a CPA. I work in an audit firm in Colombia. It's KPMG, it's like called one of the big fours in, in the world. I come here because thanks to my partners in Tor, we set up my hoopah for this coming Sunday. We are going to do like a traditional wedding thanks to him. So Andres and Hazel are actually civilly married for a couple of years now, two or three years, and they don't really have much of a background. In I went to apply for a program in Israel for over a month. I was over there when I came back to Colombia. We got married by the civil law. Like after a while, I started to study with parents in Torah. He seemed to be telling me how he was interested in learning more, finding out more about his Jewish heritage. We have been studying for over, I guess, seven months. We have been to start in Pirkei was it's taking it slow because I'm asking him too many questions. So sometimes I send him back to his rabbi with some question that I ask him. We have been only for like three chapters, but like we're going slow, but we're going pretty good. They basically have a kosher home, kosher food. There's mezuzahs on their walls, thanks to partners in Torah, actually. Um, one day my partner told me like, why we don't get married by the chupa? My previous partner in Torah, who I was learning with earlier, his name is Label from Muncie, previously Lenny from Las Vegas. He got married this year. I attended his wedding and it was a beautiful event. And I was learning with Andres during that whole period and I told him about it and it was, it was just a, it was a nice, it was a beautiful thing. And, and I think that's where that idea sparked from that I told him, hey, you know, why don't you guys do this? This is the perfect time. We worked out the details in a very short period of time. It was really like a month ago when the idea came up. He emailed me, I emailed him back, I said, let's do this, and, we, and we're here. According to the law of Moses, Moses and of Israel. And Israel. Mazel Tov. You'll change. Okay. You know, we were looking originally to find maybe a restaurant where we could arrange to have a, a, a small private area where we could have a little sheva brachas and a, a wedding kind of meal, but it ended up that Rabbi Aranagar said, come on over to my house, we'll make the meal, we'll take care of everything. Okay, so I'll see you all, you people, at uh, my home. excited when I first spoke to the people from Partners in Torah and first heard from Suruli that uh, you were going to be coming here from Colombia to uh, fulfill what you're learning, to implement the kinds of things that you're learning. That ultimately is the very purpose of learning. For over a year and a half you've been part of the Partners in Torah family, but certainly now you're also part of our family that you've joined us to celebrate your wedding. Honestly, 
I wasn't expecting anything. When first, we first started talking about the hoopah, I told my partner, I want a gypsy wedding. But then this is getting bigger and bigger. Parents in Torah called another guy from Parents in Torah over here in Miami, and he's setting up the Seuda for me. I wasn't expecting something like that. My father calls Rabbi Eli Gewertz the biggest Rosh Hashiva that there is today. He's got thousands and thousands of students, and all of them are very happy to be part of it. Parnas and Torah is a fantastic, fantastic organization. They really care and they're doing it for the right reasons and they're for real. Nos vemos en Nueva York. See you in New York. <laughs>